I'm Mark Pivak, CTO at FBR on Friday the 14th of August 2020. I'm standing in front of Hadrian number two, which is outside here at our facility in Sultana Road, building two Mexican style structures side by side on the same slab. We currently have a pilot program running with GP Vivienda. We've been dealing with the guys over there in Mexico for over a year now. GP Vivienda is a vertically integrated construction company where they build houses and they also manufacture the materials. FBR really likes to work in that environment because the vertically integrated companies can really benefit from the economies of scale. The tight integration of Hadrian into the production chain means that those companies can realise the on-flow benefits that Hadrian provides in terms of speed, accuracy, safety, waste reduction. What's really significant is that the accuracy enables parallel manufacture. So what that means is that while the houses are being built, other components can be constructed in parallel so that as soon as the brickwork's finished, those components can be installed straight on without having to wait for following trades to measure up and take dimensions and so on. So those savings lead to a lot of time savings and ultimately cost savings, a much higher quality product and a better outcome for the consumer. We started the week inside our testing facility at FBR, building two structures. The first we were able to build in a regular shift and the second we were able to shave about a quarter of the time off the build. So we're very pleased with the results. The reason we test indoors in a controlled environment is to introduce the Hadrian into building the new designs we have been given by our pilot building program partners. We are able to then process the data and apply those learnings with confidence for when we get on site in a real world environment. So with this build here over the last two days, we've been building two structures at the same time and erecting them course by course. This is a really effective way of getting structures up economically, affordably. Hadrian can lay a wide variety of blocks. The blocks that we're currently using are produced here in Australia. So moving forward, wherever we decide to base a Hadrian or use a Hadrian, we will use the blocks produced in that region for an easier, smoother integration into the building system. We're also building in light rain today. So that kind of proves out environmental conditions, which are pretty common in Europe, you know, Germany and the UK. It's a really overcast, grey day with a light drizzling rain. Uh, and as you can see behind me, Hadrian just keeps building right through that, even though I'm starting to get quite wet here. The structures that we're currently building here for GP Vivienda are a modular and very similar throughout their estates that they currently build in. We would be able to just work down the street in these developments, just printing house after house after house. The more modular the build, Hadrian thrives in that sort of environment.